And then we're gonna grab this flashlight. Holy shit, that's really bright. In this video, we're gonna be testing this $40 flashlight from Amazon to see if we can blind the security cameras at the front of our office. I also have an infrared light, which is invisible to the naked eye, but may be able to disrupt the security cameras. Be sure to watch to the end of the video because the results may surprise you. I'm about 10 feet away from the camera, so now we're gonna take this flashlight and see what it can do. So turn it on and zoom it right into the light. Oh yeah, okay. Okay, let's see uh, how that looks. So let's see if we're blind. So from 10 feet away, the camera was pretty much completely blind. But what happens if we're 30 feet away from the camera? Can we still blind it with this flashlight? So I'm gonna take this flashlight, again, zoom it right into the camera, and it looks like it's actually blinding, but it's not quite as much as before. I'll have to take a closer look at the footage, but it looks like it's actually doing a pretty good job. So, okay, that's interesting. So the cameras were pretty much blinded at the 10 feet and 30 feet tests. Now I'm going to enable WDR in the camera setting, which stands for Wide Dynamic Range. And hopefully this will help balance out a little bit. And let's see how that affects the camera. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. WDR. Turn it on. Okay. All right, now WDR is enabled on the camera. Now let's go back to our position and test again. Same thing, shine it in from 10 feet, boom. And it actually looks like we're still pretty much blind, like not really much effect. So the WDR didn't have much effect at 10 feet. Now let's try again at 30 feet. And it's a bit hard to tell, so we'll have to look at the footage after, but I think we're still blind. I think we're still blind. But how about the infrared light? Can we blind the camera using this one? Now, in order to test, I'm gonna have to turn the cameras into infrared mode. So I'm gonna do that right now. And as you can see, the image goes black and white. Now, this infrared light is pretty interesting because if I shine it, we actually can't see anything ourselves because it's invisible. So you can see it's on right now, but there's nothing here. But if we shine it into the camera, it is actually affecting the camera, which is pretty cool. And I think we have disrupted the camera successfully because I can barely tell what's going on from the camera's image. And if I walk around a bit, let's say this is on my head, <laughs> you cannot see my face at all. Okay, well, the infrared works pretty well, but so does our tamper detection. If we look on my computer and on my phone, we can see every time the camera's been blinded, we're getting a notification. We've seen that the $40 flashlight can blind the security camera, but just for fun, let's see what this flashlight can do to the security camera. This is the Astrolux MF01S, which should be about 10 times brighter than our Amazon flashlight. So just to show you how that looks, I'm gonna point the Amazon flashlight onto the street. We can see how that looks. And then we're gonna grab this flashlight. Holy shit, that's really bright. Yeah, so it's not even a competition. This flashlight is way, way, way brighter. So let's see what this does to our security camera. And wow, yeah, we cannot see anything on the camera right now. It is completely blind. <laughs> wow. Okay, so that's at about 10 feet. Now let's see what happens if we go out to 30 feet. So let's go for it. Oh, wow, yeah, that lights up. <laughs> That lights up the whole side of the building, wow. 
and we should be blind here, but I have to check the footage after to see what happens. So it turns out that you can blind a security camera using a $40 flashlight from Amazon. As a reminder, this is an educational video, so please do not go around blinding people's security cameras with your own flashlight. That would be very rude and you might get in trouble for it. But feel free to do this on your own security cameras. That's it. I hope you learned something and I hope to see you guys in the next video.